All right, gamers, we got a lot to go through, so I'm going to just go ahead and jump into right into the video. But, of course, we're back with another really quick talk about video. I don't know why my voice went all over the place. But, yeah, of course, we're back with another really quick talk about video. Though, of course, we got some new news. We got some new stuff in here, of course. Got a lot of new for JP, though. Of course, like I said, a lot of this is going to be late just because it's so much right now. Like, I'm caught with everything I pretty much need to be caught up with. It's just that, um, it's trying to, like I said, just, just cleaning up pretty much the next few days. So, I'm going to try to, like, organize go my videos out when I can. But, yeah, of course, we got High School Gohan, you guys, EZ on JP. Uh, I know Yamshuk also has easy. I haven't seen this info yet too much. I, again, I know it's proper tra translation, so I'll see. But for now, maybe cover it when it comes off of global, etc., etc. Uh, of course, um, we got a new STR Virginia. He has easy. I just got him on global, which is good. I have, now I have every pretty much world tournament card now, which is good. Uh, we got Mr. Boo, guys, easy. He was already good before. She, even Shin was good before, and they made him even more broken. Hurt, Jackie June wasn't the best. But Mr. Boo was already broken before. Let's see what he got. I thought Tech Tower was going to get his or like Kelvin Khalifa, but I think that's next World Tournament. Um, cause they're going to be disgusting. They're going to be disgusting. Um, but yeah, of course, Vegeta got his um, Awakening. And of course, he has Gohan, which I heard he was actually really disgusting and broken, though. Thank you to Minato, of course, for all the news. And of course, we got two brand new side new sub side using EZAs, are called sub side units of Injured 16. And of course, so Junior, we're going to talk about them really quick, though, as well. So yeah, let's go ahead and jump right in because we have a lot of this stuff. I want to just kind of read and talk about that, of course. But yeah, let's go ahead and get started, though, of course. This guy, honestly, he was one of the worst units in the game, so let's see what he can do now. So he does Cell Saga, Indra says Cell Saga says Androids. Indra says Cell Saga key 3, all sets on 130. Super attack effect raises, greatly raises attack, uh, great raises defense up for one turn, stream damage, the rest of the little defense. Just do passive. Key 2 attack defense at 160, guard against all attacks, plus additional attack defense of 80% when performing a super attack. High chance of doing a crit within the same turn after receiving an attack. Reduces damage received by 16% whenever guards activated up to max of 48%, plus additional attack uh, plus additional attack 80% and additional defense at 160. And I'll always get key 3 attack defense um, up 25% when there's a um, super saiyan gohan or super saiyan 2 gohan attacking the same turn, which... Oh boy, I still think this guy's just not... Uh, Oh boy! Like, so you only getting this like with Gohan, and uh, he, he can't be wrong with Gohan. Yeah, he's good. Like they did a lot for him though, which is really good. He can probably be like say really really good like on a, a good like Android team, but it's also like this is gonna hurt him because it's like he him and Gohan are not don't have a good. Like, I I'm, I'm just gonna skip. I'm not even gonna. I just it's back to. Uh, 2019 all over again. Like he's good. Like what we did, they did his passive and everything. They did really good, but also like. For him to be good, he had to have a Gohan on the team, and like I said, Indra's of South Saga has gotten better though, but it's like, I still don't, i never seen no one runs this 16, even with ZZ8, I feel like I'm not gonna say a lot of people, like he's good for what he can do, he's great, he's awesome, I just think that, um, for Indra's of South Saga, I feel, I mean, I feel like it has improved, but, at the same time, I think, this guy might not be the best on the team, because I knew, even I think with ZZ8, I feel like people might run him or not, but, I don't know, it's kind of hard, it's like, it's like a double-edged sword, it's kind of hard, like, are they going to run him on his team? I feel like he can be runnable now, but, uh, I don't know, it's, it's, it's hard to say now, honestly. I want to say he is, but also, like, uh, 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 I don't know, I just, I, I have mixed opinions. Like, he's good for what he can do and everything, it's just that. I, know, I gotta see him in action. Though. I gotta see him see if he's like if he actually is gonna be going on his team. But his link sets aren't gonna be like the best. Like you're not gonna run like Android. So I don't know. It's, uh, I don't know. I just whatever, whatever. I'm just gonna move on. I'm not I'm good. I'm not. So so juniors now they got upgrade. They were decent before, but let's see what they got. They should be called so juniors because they only focus on this one in the middle and then the, and they're just the background element of the card art. So again, they should have just made these so juniors. They really should have done that. They have opportunity right now. So, of course, opportunity me. I said that. I heard myself say that. Of course, they do artificial life forms. Artificial life forms key three. I'll set up. 130. Super attack effect. Raises attack defense up for one turn. Supreme damage. Lowers attack and defense. Passive. No, they do passive. Attack defense on 150. Plus additional attack defense up 30%. And chance to perform. Uh, and chance to dodge. Um, carriage attacks, including super attacks. Um, uh, attack plus 10% per artificial life forms category out on the team. Not too bad. Artificial life forms get key three. Attack defense up 30%. Well, additional attack that has a high chance of becoming a super attack. Launch an additional super attack that has a random. It randomly changes a certain amount of key spheres besides EGO and int. Two rainbow key spheres and then sell perfect sell perfect sell attacking the same turn. Which like I said, this guy, um, these guys weren't that bad when they first released. They were decent, but 
I think now they actually they actually have a pretty good runable unit because I saw what they can do a little bit before. And I was like, I'm impressed. Like they can probably be a good runable, runable unit though, even like without a cell or a cell junior or uh, without another cell or anything like that. But I mean, I mean, you can see what they can do. Like they're pretty much artificial life forms support unit, which honestly, I can see getting some use out of this guys. Like these guys, honestly, I can see good. I can see some use out of this. Honestly, I can see that. Yeah, I feel like they're they can actually be pretty useful, honestly. I think like they can be really, really good. Of course, on the high school Gohan. Um, oh, thank you, no links. Oh, I mean, how did he save my life? Thank you, because he had no links. He, he didn't have links for easy A's. It's really good. I can just go for Lucas Super Attack Effect. This is going to save me so much time. Thank you. So, of course, Gohan's your skill. Um, uh, uh, so, all Super Class allies get key 3 on sets of 77%. Super Attack Effect. Raise, great, raise attack for one turn. Um, raise defensive for one turn. Supreme damage. How many intense stunning? His new passive attack defense at 150. Holy crap. 158. Another attack defense of 58 percent when performing a super attack reduces difficulty by 58 percent. Super class allies get key three attack defense of 30 percent, attack defense up attack defense uh, plus 58 percent, and attacked enemies attack minus 20 percent for two turns when facing an extreme class enemy. Okay, that's actually not too bad. It's very simple and very, very simple down, honestly. And for all you could do with attack and defense, the more attack and defense when doing a super attack, super class allies buff and like just more key and support for them and the damage reduction. For two turns, in, in general, like in, for that's also pretty good. Also pretty good. Not too bad. Again, like I said, it's weird because all you see is have like the four, four stuff for the passive fifth stuff, and then go on to like a category book for something else later. Honestly, not too bad for high school. Go on, that's actually pretty good for him though. Honestly, I like that. That's actually really good for him. On to Vegeta, of course, he does all that key three. Uh, all, all allies key three. Says all allies. All allies key three. I'll say it. I'll say it. Key three. All sets of seventy percent. This um super attack effect now, greatly raise attack defensive for one turn. So damage, greatly raise defense, and steal super attack. That is disgusting. Attack defense up 150, and attack defense up 100 percent We're pulling a super attack. He's pretty much high school Gohan. Key one up to max of five. Attack plus 20% up to max of 100 with each attack received. Um great chance of to guard all attacks and a great chance of form a crit of 50% up to max of 60 with each attack received. Well, there's another master evolution category ally attacking the same turn. Like I said, you're gonna run other Super Saiyan Vegeta's over him, but he's actually not a bad choice, honestly, though. For like all those other Super Vegeta's in the game, he could be a good choice in the game in the later future. So, I mean, that's actually pretty good for what he can do, honestly. That's actually not too, too bad. Pretty good for what he can do. And I mean, my internet cut out my big computer. I just saw that. It does that a lot, though, when I'm not using it. So, it automatically cuts off, which actually is really good. So, I did, you like, use too much power. I just noticed that right there. Oh, they could just cut out, but honestly, it's not too bad for Vegeta, honestly. Like, pretty much like High School Gohan, just, um, he's the Master Evolution category. Instead of, like, buffs, he just, he's pretty much buffing himself up a lot, so. I think he's attack going up to good heights. That's actually really good for Vegeta. Honestly, I'm impressed with this EZA so far. Mr. Boo, I've been wanting to wait for him. All allies get key 3 attack defense of same percent. Uh, key 12 attack, uh, greater raise the defense of for 1. Ah, yeah. I don't know why I'm assuming to her. Um. So there's a noise in the background. I don't know if you guys can hear it because it's, um, um, uh, um, give me a second. Because, um, sorry, noise in the background. I just, I don't know if you probably guys can't hear it, but for me, it's, it's, it's annoying a little bit. Come on, noise, go away. Give me a second. I was really getting on my nerves. I think that's why I can't hear because my noise canceling. But all right, also, um, Mr. Bill, I'll be waiting for this one for a bit. All allies get key three. I'll set up 70%. Super attack effect. Uh, uh, effect. I cannot speak right now. Holy crap. Great way is defensive for one turn. Supreme damage. Lowers attack. Not bad. All boo, boo units end up doing this anyway. Mr. Boo, Super Boo. I think usually stun or seal super attack. One or two. Um, passive. Attack defense at 120. Uh, I don't know why I said that. Is that an attack plus up 120? Um, we're performing a super attack, changes int to, um, int, changes int, and key spheres are another, of another type to rainbow, uh, key spheres. Attack defense up 50%, this is different, it recovers 30,000 HP, um, per room key sphere obtained, this attack can, that can probably also be very helpful. Reduces damage received by 50% when clicking two more key sphere, rainbow key spheres, and for each key, rainbow key sphere obtained, and from 
third onwards reduces difficulty by ten by an additional ten percent. Oh, he's not bad though, cause for what he does, he does a lot. He does a lot of healing anyway, so the little extra damage reduction could probably help you out. Maybe it's only ten percent though, so I mean, whatever, so whatever. Um, I mean, but hey, like I said, I mean, that can like I said, he already does so much already with his orb changing and everything. So again, not bad though. Like I said, with all four super attacks, they all do a similar thing. Like you know, flat boost, super attack effect, then they're like the super attack, then like they do something different for them, like a key switch into like attack up or a support item, something, but. Not too bad, honestly. Not too bad for Boo. Um, like I said, Boo seems already crazy, though, so I mean, hey. Okay, I'm back. Um, For some reason, my computer was being really weird, but I am back, though. Of course, I was going over Shin's info. He actually doesn't seem too bad, though, but I'll go reread his info anyway. So he does, uh, all set, he does Tech Taps Key 3, all sides up 70%. His 12 key greatly raises his attack and defense up for one turn. Uh, or just, yeah, for one turn, Supreme Damage, High Chance to Stun, his passive now. Attack defense at 150. High Chance of Aiding Enemies Attacks, including Super Attacks. An additional chance of dodging, pretty much, including super attacks, up to 10%, up to 20% within the same turn. Each, each attack is dodged, plus an additional um, chance to dodge, attack including super attacks, up to 20%, and attack defense at 150 when this character is the first attacker on the turn. Attack defense at 150 when, this ki when, ki when attacking this character is second or third in the attacker on the turn. Like I say, he pretty much just dodges, honestly. Um, performs an additional attack that has a high chance, the great chance of coming a super attack. Within the same turn, this character evades an attack. Uh, attack goes 100% for three turns after the character dodges an attack. Not too bad, though. Honestly, like I say, pretty much dodges in every slot he pretty much is in. But more, a little bit more, more attack and defense, you can, you know, put him in the second or third slot. Um, but if you really want to dodge, you know, kind of build it up. Again, he's just you're building up his dodge. Not too bad, though. Honestly, he seems like a really good unit though, for what he can do and everything. That could be some. That could be honestly pretty fun. With all the tournament teams and stuff like that, of course. On, I guess, some of the disappointments, I was like, it's in I, I keep thinking the Inch Jackie June, this one and the LR one are the same. I'm like, wait a second, why well, is it getting an awakening? But no, that's like probably n two more tournaments or a few more, honestly, after that. I don't know, I can't remember right now, but yeah. So, it's leader skill, um, what's up, key three? Um, all sets up 90%, super attack effect. Greater with this attack for one turn, supreme damage, seal super attack, uh, passive key two attack defense of 100% when and attack defense up another attack defense of 100% when performing a super attack, low chance of evade enemies attacks including super attacks. Why can't just dodge regularly? Attack was up 30% up to max of 150 chance of evade enemies attacks, including super attacks up to 20% up to max of 60 with each attack received. Um, Defense of 30% up to max of 150, a chance to form a crit of 20%, up to max of 60 when an attack is invaded, so if KO attacks are HP 10% or above. That's nothing crazy, honestly. I mean, it's not bad, it's just that you had to build him up a lot, though, so that is kind of a little bit of a disappointment there for him, though, but I don't think no one's ever really used Jackie Chun. Honestly, I forgot he even existed in the whole entire game. But that's pretty much all the Tournament Awakening, all the new Awakenings we got for the sub easy and all that stuff, of course. Pretty good, pretty simple, pretty easy, though, but yeah, see you guys there, though. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Grab the Poker Joke again, though. Enjoy it. safe. Watching the couple's overview, going up and wear a mask, and toilet paper, ruining to the face of can. Go side to the guys from Copium, shout out all my friends on Discord, social media, you guys are awesome. We can think about all this info, though, of course, like to hit again. Very simple, very easy, like I said, though, today. But not bad for the Awakenings. All of them look good. Besides, I mean, Jackie Chun seems decent. I'm um, not like, oh my gosh, the worst, but I mean, that's nothing really crazy there for him anyway. But every unit doesn't do that bad. 16's kind of a mixed bag for me. Like, he could be good, but it's just. Uh, uh, uh. See you guys later, though, again, though. Peace out.